Good morning guys, today we're doing a uh, breakfast at the canteen little vlog. I totally didn't update you because I kind of went from like a grad school announcement to a video and then suddenly I was like boom in Beijing doing a tour of uh, the Communication University of China. So what happens is that school at Tsinghua doesn't start until the end of August um, and I had a few months to spare here before so I was like might as well go to Beijing and top up my Chinese and the program that was open uh, from the end of February to uh, June was this one at the Communication University of China. So that's why I'll be here for um, four months. So right now I'm walking to the canteen. This is the track and then the campus is really big. We have a lot of buildings, we have residential areas, and usually I wake up at 7, 7.30 to go for a run on the track. But as you can see, well I don't know if you can see, but I can feel, <laughs> and it says on the pollution index that today is not a great day for that, um, so I won't be doing that. Um, for those of you that are interested, I am in uh, level 4, so it's like middle level Chinese because I can speak it fine and I can listen, but I can't read as well as I should be able to because I never really learned uh, Chinese like through proper Chinese school. So this is the field right now and if you see that haze, that means that yeah, it's a little bit polluted. So I have class today at 10 and uh, let's go eat. So this way to the canteen. Okay, so we grab a tray and this is what we have. You have a shui zhu ji dan. Look at all this, guys. So we use our student card to pay. Xiaomi Zhou Like that. Okay, now I'm gonna find a quiet place to go eat this. Alright, so I'm all settled down to eat. Uh, that was 270 RMB, which uh, converts to like 50 cents Canadian. Um, I usually have I will have fruit after this and just they don't have fruit at this canteen. And I don't know, I just can't do dairy in China. Um, but yeah, Xiaomi Zhou looks like this. It's like congee and then a boiled egg. They have a lot of selections, like a lot of Chinese dishes, but I just can't do that in the morning yet. I don't know if it's my stomach being a little bit of a pussy or like it's all the oil, but I, I can't eat those things in the morning. Um, they look really, really good, but um, I gotta keep my breakfast sort of light. And I usually come to this canteen and I study before class. Um, at lunch, it fills up really fast. And I'll take you to look around uh, the other options they have. Uh, besides what I chose here in a second. Okay. 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 Wow, and look at the bacon. Wow, it's like... It looks really good. So this one's called shallot pancake. And... I think this is desserts. And like dim sum style stuff. And then we have like malatang. They usually fill this up with um, 
vegetables and as you can see here this is all getting prepared for today's lunch craze um, and this is uh, done by the weight and then they put it in like a big bowl and for our friends and all like our spicy food they're getting ready for the lunch like I said and we also have some Western options <laughs> so we can get our own pastas and sandwiches right there as you can see okay so I did say that I was gonna get some fruits because I don't have any fruits for breakfast all right it's time for my fruits. Uh, I'm on break right now. Uh, yeah. So the prices here are 10 to 15 per cup. I usually like to stock up on a lot of vitamin C. So pineapple, kiwi, orange juice. Um, I haven't eaten anything here, but we also have a supermarket. And this is the school supermarket where we get a lot of stuff. Groceries and everything. And Kwaila Ai, fruit, yogurt, and fresh tea. They have really amazing fruit parfaits. They look like this. I'm gonna get one later today. Um, and then we have also Tang uh, Hulu plus corn, yams, and sausages. And this is the other canteen here. So my dormitory is actually like two minutes walk from here, so it's really convenient for me to get stuff. We also have a flower store, and then electronics, and uh, even a sunglasses store. So, Literally super convenient to get anything here and yeah like the supermarket sells everything from stationery to chips and we have like laundry back there so some random stuff like I don't think I'd ever try this unless it was on dare but eggs and yeah people usually come here between class to get their snacks um, but I did want to show you the chips because there are some really weird flavors. Um, where are they? Hold on. Okay, they moved the chips, that's why I couldn't find them. Um, Lay's, we have wasabi flavor. We also have yogurt flavor. We have um, grilled squid and roasted chicken wing flavor plus Italian red meat and Texas grilled barbecue. So, um, oh, and the weirdest one, cute cucumber flavor. So, uh, yeah, if you want to see me do a video filming me eat all these crazy lace flavors, comment down below. And then this is the staple of all university students, the instant noodles. <laughs> but I try to eat less of that. All right, I think my drink is ready now. Let's go get that. Um, here. All right, so we pay with our QR code and a small one is 10. All right, got my vitamin C, my pineapple orange juice, and now getting ready to head back to class. <laughs> wait, 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 you gotta do like a switch. All right, guys, it is cafeteria madness. We're here with my friends. Hello, hello. Grabbing lunch. Let's see what is good. Uh, 
，我们要开始吃了，呃，吃一下先，汤。家我朋友在吃冰冰吧，嗯，啊、uh、哈 -huh ，然后我的面。<笑>啊、so because I eat at the canteen a lot, um, breakfast, snacks, and lunch. For dinner, I ordered a salad、uh, with chicken, egg, and lots of veggies, and it came out to 20 RMB, which is around four. Dollars, so really cheap.